Hi, and welcome to Reading Buddies with Sloan. Today, we're going to be reading Chicken Eggs. Marge and Lolo took one look at the post from the barn door and almost lost their cluck. Elvis Poultry was top bird. They had to win those tickets. The ducks paraded by. Don't bother drumsticks. Ducks win every year. All a chicken can do is balk, flap, and shake. Marge and Lola ignored the quackers and tested out their talents. Bowling was out. So was juggling and tightrope walking. We could try flying, Marge said. Lola grinned. Flying chickens? Now that's talent. The chickens scrambled to the top of the coop. They jumped, they fluttered. They sank in hay up to their waddles. The ducks flew by. Bail out chickens, they called down below. Marge and Lola dusted themselves off and shook hay from their feathers. Now what, asked Lola. We could try swimming, said Marge. Lola nodded. Swimming chickens? Now that's talent. The chickens tottered to the pond. They jumped, they fluttered, they totally sank. The ducks swam by. Get some floaties, chickens. Marge and Lola waded ashore and spit water from their beaks. Any other big ideas? asked Lola. Marge stared at the setting sun. Too late, it's showtime. We'll have to wing it. The chickens bumbled to the barn, found their seats, and settled in for the show. The goats ate a tractor and scored a seven. Not bad, said Marge. The pigs formed a pyramid and scored an eight. I've seen better, said Lola. The cows jumped over the moon. That's old, said Lola. We can still win this thing. Suddenly, trumpets sounded. The crowd gasped. The ducks grabbed their boards and hit the water. They scored. A nine. The barnyard went wild. Smirking at the chickens, the ducks flounced back to their seats. We're on, said Marge. We're doomed, said Lola. The chickens shuffled on stage. They blinked at the crowd and gulped. What's the matter, yelled a duck. Are you chicken? This put the chickens in a foul mood. They balked, they flapped, they shook. More, 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 the crowd chanted. Marge and Lola looked at each other. But we're just doing regular chicken stuff, Marge whispered. Regular chicken stuff? Now that's talent. Lola grabbed a mic. Let's balk and roll. The chickens balked and flapped and shook all over stage. They scored. An 8.5. Losers, the ducks called out as they plucked their tickets from the prize table. Ducks rule. Marge and Lola gazed at the tickets and wiped their eyes. Then, from the top of the barn, a voice crooned, You chicks rocked! A rooster swooped to the stage. You had me all shook up. Elvis poultry was in the building. Elvis smoothed his crest. I could use an act like yours. Before Marge and Lola could say a word, duck feathers flew. The ducks lunged at the chickens when... Thunk, thunk, thunk. The cows came home, scoring a perfect 10. The next day, a new poster was tacked on every barn in the countryside. 
Elvis Poultry and the Chicken Dancers, on stage, live, Marge and Lola, the Big Bok Bagok, 50 Barns in 50 Days, coming to a farm near you. And the end, that's the end of Chicken Dance. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Thank you.